Smoking time. Go, go, mega fast. Hello everyone, welcome, and in today's episode we're having a look at Power Rangers Megaforce. Um, previously we looked at the Gosei Morpher, we also looked at the Gosei Great Megazord, and now we're having a look at the basic 4 inch figures, and uh, we're going to be starting it off with the Red Ranger, from Power Rangers Megaforce. So this is the Red Ranger on Mega Force. Very basic for the packaging and stuff like that, but um, anyway, let's jump in today's episode. Pounders Mega Force, Red Ranger. Let's take a look in today's episode. Hello everyone, welcome to Cute Anime Figures TV. I'm your host, Craig. And today we're looking at Power Rangers Mega Force, and uh, we're having a look at the four-inch basic figures from the new series of Power Rangers, which is Power Rangers Mega Force. So as you can probably see, um, these are the basic four-inch figures, uh, just like the samurai figures that they brought out last year. Um, they have brought some more out of the uh, samurai ones, you still can get a hold of them um, in your local toy stores and stuff like that, you know, Toys R Us and Toy Master and all the toy places. Anyway, uh, today we're looking at the Red Ranger, so his name in the show is Troy, um, I believe. I haven't seen very much of it, but I believe his name is Troy. Um, which I'm correct. So the Blue Ranger must be Noah. Um, I have no idea who the Black Ranger is, or the pink, or the yellow. But we'll, ha we'll also have a look at those. Also, one of the bad guys, um, well, one of the villains, Vac. And also, we'll have a look at uh, Robo Knight, which is this one right here. We do have Robo Knight. Uh, we haven't got one of these yet, a Lugie, which are like mini minions, you know, um, similar to the buddies from Power Rangers, something like that. But anyway, let's take a look at the Red Ranger from Power Rangers Mega Force, and they also come with these power cards, which I'll show off um, where they go save more for in today's video review. Let's take a look at the Red Ranger from Power Rangers Mega Force. Take a look. So here we are with Power Rangers Megaforce, and here we are with our first uh, Megaforce uh, four-inch figure review. Uh, today we're looking at the Red Ranger from Power Rangers Megaforce. So these are the um, four-inch figures, and as you can probably see, it says ten centimeter on there. Um, anyway, so this is the new packaging for the Megaforce, you got Bandai there, top, um, these are made by Bandai, uh, this year, of 2013, um, you get a power card that is included with all of the figures from the, uh, Megaforce series, and you can also use those, um, with the Gosei Morpher. So as you can probably see the packaging, you got the logo here, Power Rangers Mega Force. You got a nice picture here of the Red Ranger. It says Red Ranger on the packaging. Um, for accessories, by all looks it, it comes with a uh, power blaster and one of the power or the battle gear uh, weapons that it uses in the show. Let's take a look at the side here. It says um, Two ways to play. So that you guys can get a good look at that. 
Also on the side here, just showing it off that you can download a free app for it as well. And on the back of the packaging here, as you can probably see, there's um, all of them here that you can collect. You can get the Blue Ranger, Red Ranger, the Light Ranger, Robo Knight, Pink Knight, yeah, Pink Ranger, Vac, Yellow Ranger, and Lugie for this first wave. There is also some Ultra um, versions of these and metallic versions of the Mega Force. Uh, Rangers, um, I don't know when they're out. Um, yeah, over here. But um, also, you can get the Mighty Morphin Red Ranger in this series as well, uh, which is kind of like a metallic figure. But anyway, that's what they all look like on the back of the packaging. Uh, we will take a look at all of these. I've got them all, apart from Louie. Um, I've got him. I ain't got that one yet, but. Hopefully, we might take a look at that one. I don't know. Um, but we've got the other ones that we might have a look at. So, packaging, not too bad. It's just a uh, very, very basic uh, packaging. You've got a sticker here indicating you get one power card. Um, so, let's actually go ahead and open up the Red Ranger from Power Rangers Mega Force. Um, obviously, Later on, uh, they will obviously do SH figure arts of these. Um, it's okay getting these at the moment um, if you don't want to wait until the figure arts versions, which are really super detailed and comes with lots of interchangeable hands and um, different accessories. They may come with exact similar accessories, but uh, scale to the actual figure and all that uh, kind of awesome stuff. Um, they did actually do Robo Knight in the SH figure arts. Um, that was the very first, you know, Ghost Age uh, figure arts figure that they've done. Um, unfortunately, I don't have it. Um, hopefully, I can get one. But anyway, bring back to the uh, Red Ranger. Um, I will show the power card off with the Gose Morpher. I do have the Gose Morpher. So let's actually open this up. Um, it's just similar to the Samurai packaging. Uh, got a thing here just to tab this off like that. Stuff like that. Pretty cool. Okay, let's try and get it open here. This here, but and can I just uh, slip the ranger out here, just like that. Also, power card is actually attached by tape, mostly. Oh boy, let's just cut this tape because. I'm going to have the power cards anyway with the figure, it doesn't matter. We take them out of the package. Uh, doesn't matter. So, yeah, that's that. You can just there's nothing in there, just showing you a nice picture of, you know, go say. So, putting the package into the side, and uh, we'll uh, get the card out. Just to uh, get this sealed. Hopefully, you guys can see this. Uh, see what I'm doing. So, hopefully we can get this out of here. Hopefully these will come in like, you know, boost pack style uh, packaging, uh, something like that. Um, let's wrap that like that. Down the floor. So here's the uh, power card. 
Um, it's a bit different to um, what you got with the Gose Morpher. Uh, here's a good look at that. It says Red, Red Mike Force Ranger, stuff like that. Now, this is the new card system. Um, I believe they have this uh, same similar thing in uh, in Japan and also uh, in America as well with the uh, toy line because it actually came out in the US uh, before we got it. Um, so, yeah, pretty awesome. Um, let's actually have a look at this figure, and it's very basic indeed. Um, like I said, with all these basic figures, they don't come with much, and they're not. You know, they're okay. Um, I'm not going to go into too much detail with this. It could be a short review, guys. Yeah, I'll do a comparison with. Oh, there we go. I'll do a comparison with uh, the Red Samurai Ranger. Floor there. So here's the. Uh, Red Ranger from Megaforce. And he's got his little uh, Gose Morpher there. I just can get a good look at that. <laughs> Very tiny there. The Gose Morpher. Really like how that's on there. And also, there's a little thing here um, so you can put away the blaster. Um, I still don't get why they've got uh, you know, these code things here, uh, I don't know. I have no idea. So, articulation is probably just that same basic articulation as the uh, you know, the samurai figures and stuff. Pretty cool. Got the little Gose logo there. If I can actually show you. Can you see it? The little Gose logo there. Nice helmet. Really nicely detailed though. Um, they will be very super detailed when when they start doing the figure arts. And uh, uh, hopefully I'll. Um, start buying them as well um, which I do have other figure arts as well which I am still need to get eh, not so bad paint job not too good um, not too bad actually uh, there's a little bit of I don't know if you can see this yeah a little bit plain blush there like they haven't painted it Oh, yeah. The belt looks nicely detailed. You'll say belt, yeah. That's where they actually have the cards in and stuff like that. Which is a really nice uh, figure, basic. Um, you've got the articulation here. I'll start off with the head. That's from side to side. You can turn it all the way around, but I'm not going to. Um, eyes go in and out. Rotate 360. Like I said, in and out. You can only bend up to the muscle point there. And also I'll rotate at the wrist. Well, the forearm wrist part there. Hands are kind of like a soft, you know, rubber plastic. Um, no waist articulation. You got this type of articulation goes in and out. Only to there. Uh, what's hindering it is the Gose Morpher on the side here. It, it is removable. I'm not going to do it. It's that same thing like that. Um, it does have like a knee joint there. Swivel at the boot. No articulation at the foot or anything like that. It's just as basic as that. So yeah. Just as basic. Okay, let's see what accessories um, the Mega Force uh, Red Ranger comes with. Not bad design though. Loving the design. Um, 
Stands up pretty good. Now let's have a look at this gun. You can actually get these in the role playing uh, toys. Um, I'll have to remind, remind myself to buy one of these. As you can probably see here. Nice. And as you can probably see, it's just usual that uh, they're, they're all painted in one color. Um, usually, the figure arts are all much detailed than this um, and stuff like that. And that that's what makes them much uh, better than the four inch ones. But they're still nice to have. That and stuff. Yeah, pretty cool. You can probably have it in his hand if you want to. In any. Can I put it in that hand if you want? There it is with the blaster in his hand. Very cool indeed. So you can probably have it in either hand. We'll just show that off. So he's got the blaster in his hand. Zoom in here. Let's just move that to the side there. And just zoom in here. You guys can get a good look. Right here. So as you can probably see, he's got the blaster in his hand. Um, can't really see much other than it's a four-inch figure. Um, I do actually have some of the samurai ones. Okay, so that's the same with the blaster. Um, let's actually take a look at uh, him with the uh, what do you call it? It's the name of the weapon he comes with. That'll be on one of these cards here. Um, Dragon Sword or whatever it was called. Something like that. See I have so many power card power cards. These are the ones that had to do with the Megzord and the ones to do with the Morpher and stuff like that. So It is worth picking up. I'm trying to get the card for him. Um, unless, uh, okay, here's the sword. As you can probably see it's just it's fairly detailed. Um, no, as you can probably see. I don't know if this combines or not, I'm, I'm not too sure, um, you know, if you combine them all, I don't know. But anyway, that's the sword. Let's actually attach it to the ranger, let's actually get up there, looks like it's made of a bigger thing on there. Now it's like a little peg thing here and a hole on the belt, and you can actually attach it to the side there so you, you know you can actually have it there which is pretty nice um, they've done the exact same thing as the samurai rangers and um, okay let's actually have him with the um, sword in his hand and, and eh, it kind of fits okay in his hand let's have it like that Cool. Get a good look at it. No, really nice. Okay. Yeah, that. So yeah, um, I can't really say much. I can only say it now um, they're only a four-inch line. Uh, Expect the SH3 Alps ones to be much uh, better detail than uh, than than the four inch ones, uh, but not too bad to have. Um, it's just that these are only basic ones. So anyway, let's actually take a look at the power card that he comes with, and then I'll do a comparison with the 
red samurai ranger. Um, it goes in more for that. It's here. So I'll move the ranger out of the way. Just put that there. Move to the background there. Can stand up. So here's the Gosei Morpher. Um, this thing is fantastic, by the way. I'm already loving it. Um, just actually pull this down. And as you can probably see, the Red Ranger card is pretty different. Um, this is the exact same cards that you'll find with the rest of the Rangers. Um, and Red Rangers is pretty different. Just put that there. And as you can process, let's actually do a compare here. Let's compare these two before we actually put it in more for. Um, as you can probably see, the different. You actually see the range of in fall. There, excuse me. Um, I know I just had some lunch, not long since. Um, overall, um, As you can probably just see there, it's, you know, a bit different um, compared to uh, each other. But they the sound the same. Um, that's probably one thing you're probably wondering. Do they sound the same? Um, I'll put this one back in and I'll show you. So this is the uh, one that came with the morpher. That's the one that came with the morpher. Now this is the one that actually came with the ranger itself. Yeah, a bit different. So it says Megaforce Red uh, Ranger, and this is just a uh, standard one that you get with the Morpher. Yep, yeah, so that's the Morpher. I'll just set that to the side. Well, let's actually do a comparison with the. Um, with the Samurai Ranger. So, yeah, the, that's the only card you get, which is this one, which is this one card. Um, you can probably pick this up with the, um, with the others. Um, so it's got number two of them on there. Yeah, it's got number one on there. So yeah, uh, they are different cards apart from this one says Red Mega Force Red Ranger. Just like you'll probably expect it with the words. They all say, you know, like SPD Red. Um, you know, like Wild Force Red, Mystic Force Red, Jungle, uh, yeah, Red Jungle Fury Red, Ninja Storm Red. And whatever the thing is. So these are like most of the cards that you get uh, when you actually get the basic figures, and plus if you own the Megazord, um, they're not that bad. Um, that's uh, pretty cool. Okay, well, let's actually do a comparison here with the uh, Red Ranger from the Samurai. Unfortunately, I don't have the regular one. Um, I've got the mega form version of him where they all jump up into the midair and go into their megazord. Um, so, I have the regular version of the Green Ranger one. 
um, as well as the megaphone of that. Okay, here's the megaphone of the Red Ranger from Samurai. As you can probably see, it actually has this great big uh, um, sword. I forgot what it's, the name of it. Uh, let's skip my mind. But anyway, that's the um, Red Ranger from Samurai. Um, let's bring this back here and make a comparison here. And they're probably the same height, um, it's just that that big sword um, that uh, yeah, it's just holding him back and weighted a bit. Um, let's actually have a look at them together. They don't actually look too bad from the back though. Um, So there you go. Uh, the, the comparison between the two is exactly the same height. Um, the you know the stuff that they have on the back, the figures, it's not too noticeable as it is on the Samurai Rangers, um, as it is on the you know other ones. Apart from that, they have a bunch of numbers. Slot on the back of the, well, back of the Rangers. Um, there's none of that on the figure arts, which is pretty cool. Um, so yeah, well, let's actually go into my final thoughts for the Red Ranger uh, for our Mega Force. So I'll just uh, move uh, Samurai um, Red Ranger or Shinken Red. As everybody knows that. Um, um, they're not that bad, these uh, basic figures. Um, like I said, They will probably bring out figure arts. Um, you might as well, uh, for some of you collectors out there, you might as well uh, wait. Um, but if you want the cards, you know, fair enough. You know, go and buy the four inch ones for them, for the cards. Um, I absolutely have no idea what you do get with the. Uh, So yeah, anyway, before I start to mess around with packaging, so here's the packaging. So, yeah, I have no idea uh, what you get with the um, starter set uh, for these trading cards. I have no idea what's in there, what's packed. Um, maybe I will get it, I don't know. Depends on how busy I am. Um, but uh, obviously I'll be in some more figure arts. But uh, anyway, um, yeah, Power Rangers Mega Force. Um, the toys are out now. Um, go get them if you haven't. Um, there's various places you can get them over here in uh, in the UK. You can go to. Uh, Toys R Us, you can go to Smith's Toy Store, uh, you can go to Toy Master. Um, so they're the various places you can get these uh, Mega Force figures and the Power Rangers Samurai um, figures as well. Uh, yeah, that's just about uh, it really. Um, they're not that bad, uh, they're just basic. 
orange figures. Um, the only thing I can recommend picking it up for is for the power card. Um, if you're not planning on uh, buying anything else, well, you definitely actually need the Ghost Eater Morpher to activate it, obviously, like, but uh, um, that's just another thing to buy. <laughs> but overall, um, they're that basic. Um, so, it looks pretty cool though, and it's still really nice. Um, I highly recommend picking up the figure arts um, of these when they do ever release those. They are really really disgusting night. But anyway, um, overall, it's just great figures. I haven't got any problems with any of the 4 inch figures at all. Um, obviously the ones I have got, I haven't got any problems with them. Not, uh, pick it up if you if you're a big fan of Power Rangers. Um, um, if you are going to be celebrating the new season, or, like the May Force, um, that's why I picked up the four-inch ones is to celebrate the new season and uh, just to celebrate, you know, the 20th anniversary of the Power Rangers uh, for Mighty Morphin. But anyway, you know, they're not that bad. Uh, they are what they are, you know, basic figures. Uh, obviously, they'll be super articulated and very super detailed when they bring the figure out. Um, but overall, if you want the whole team right now, you can just go out and buy them uh, from your local toy stores and stuff, either online or in store. Well, that's just about it. All I've got to say is that uh, the Red Ranger is fantastic. Um, I love the design of the helmet and the uniform, uh, the Power Blaster, uh, the Morpher. You know, I love every detail of them. Um, it's probably one of my favorite ones. But uh, that could all change when I look at the other ones. But still loving the Red Ranger. Also, I'm a big fan of the Green Ranger as well for my morphin. Um, anyway, so these are the f basic 4 inch ones. Um, I'll see you uh, next time um, when we'll take a look at the Blue Ranger and uh, also the Black Ranger, then the Yellow, and then the Pink, and then Robo Knight, and then obviously Black Hobby, the last. Uh, Mega Force uh, review uh, for so far and to, until we get the um, Lion Robo Knight Megazord, and also uh, the, there will probably be a display video of all five Ghost Aim Offers on display with all five of the power cards. Hopefully, we can make that happen. Um, but anyway, until next time, thank you so much for watching. Uh, hopefully, hopefully you enjoy this uh, review of the Red Ranger from Power Rangers Mega Force. It's out now. Go and pick him up if you haven't. Do so. Highly recommend him. And uh, add him to your team of 4 inch figures. They do go great with the samurai ones, though. That, uh, but anyway, until then, until next time, take care, thanks for watching, arigato, and sayonara. And here's the display video, with him on display. So here we are, um, with the Mega Force Red Ranger, from Power Rangers Mega Force. So these are the basic 4 inch figures, to the to do with the Mega Force series. As you can probably see, we have Mega Force Red Ranger on display, along with the Gose Great Megazord, the RPM Megazord, and the Samurai Megazord. So let's take a closer look at him on display. So here he is on display. He looks pretty good. 
it will do when all the other ranges are on display. You can really see I've got my Megazords in here. They're not that bad. Uh, they look great when they're all complete and they're all chaired all together. So there you go, there's the Megaforce uh, Red Ranger. Definitely check him out if you want the Red Ranger Power Card. Yeah, but also you'll get that with the Ghost Save Morpher. But anyway, until next time, thanks for watching, and I'll see you very, very soon. Next, we'll check out the Blue Ranger in the next episode. Until then, take care. Arigato and sayonara. Until then, take care. Morphin' time. Go, go, Mega Force.